I'm Mohamed Trefei, eight-time U.S. record holder, and this is the Biomed Bulletin. Live from the Biomedical Wing at Eastside High School, this is the Biomed Bulletin with your hosts, Mr. Gonzalez and Mr. Gomez. These are this week's top stories. All right, I'll grab them. Man. Hey, they need you on the set. All right, let's go. You like that? not going to happen today, guys. Hey, we have, we have a thousand subscribers. You don't know? Oh, that's right. Hey, can we get your autograph so I can give it to my baby? Oh, always there for a fan. Yeah. All right, you guys enjoy this. Right. You Thank you. That, no problem. Good morning, and thank you for joining us for this action-packed, informative, entertaining, eye candy-filled episode of the Biomed Bulletin. Speaking of eye candy, we know that it will be a challenge for you during spring break, not having to see us for an extra week, these beautiful faces. And so, by popular demand, we put together this quick montage that will help you get through spring break a little bit better. You're welcome. I'm Mr. Gomez. And I'm Mr. Gonzalez. And this is Mrs. Coffee. Thank you, Mr. Gonzalez and Mr. Gomez. And congratulations on having over 1,000 subscribers. You guys really are big slaps. I said it, are you happy? Freshmen, sophomores, juniors, and seniors, on behalf of your biomed teachers, we just want to say thank you for a great third quarter. We appreciate your hard work and dedication, and especially to those who took advantage of all the supports and extra credit opportunities. We look forward to a successful fourth quarter. Also, as a reminder, quarter three grades will lock very soon, so check your grades now and communicate with your teachers if anything looks off. Before we get into the Biomed Senior of the Month, we have a new segment called Historical Student of the Week. This week, we wanna congratulate Principal Charlie Dunn on being Sophomore of the Month, March 1906. The Biomed Senior of the Month, Diego Morales. We're not surprised to hear this because he has been a great student from the beginning. Congratulations, Diego. And now, Mr. Gomez with a special sports announcement. Sports are back and competitions have started. As of now, only three guests are allowed in games for each athlete. So in order to bring you all the action, Go EdTech Go will be live streaming games. Subscribe today by clicking on the icon here so you do not miss out on all the fun. Now here's the schedule of this week's competitions. Go Lions! Interested in competing for an Eastside High School team? please fill out the Eastside High School Sports Interest Form that can be found in the description below and the coach of that sport will contact you. Remember, to compete, you must complete the online clearance. You can find the link to the tutorial video on how to do that above or in the description below. You must have a current physical on file as well. All sports are still accepting athletes, so get these done ASAP. You don't wanna miss out on the opportunity to represent Eastside on the field or on the court. Boys and girls cross country remain undefeated in the Golden League. This Saturday, they will finish off their season by hosting Little Rock at 10 o'clock a.m. Good luck to all the runners. For this week's Boys Athlete of the Week, we have cross country runner Jesus Flores. Jesus led the team again this week and helped the boys team remain undefeated in Golden League competition. For the girls, we have Chase Gomez who dropped three minutes from her previous time. 
Congratulations to you both. Your book is now accepting applications for next year. If you want to be involved in highlighting some of the great things that happen next year and being a part of a fun and exciting class, consider applying for your book now by filling out the form in the description below. And now, a message from Principal Dunn. You got this, Mr. Dunn! I'm excited to announce the April Teachers of the Month. Congratulations to Mr. Luis Jimenez and Mr. Gonzalez? Which Gonzalez? This month, it's the Gonzalez with an S. Congratulations. Good news, Lions. We have exciting news about our return to campus. We don't have a firm date yet, but it will be during the month of April. Over the past week, you received a preference survey from the district office, as well as several emails from me regarding whether you will be coming back to distance learning or coming back to campus. Please complete this survey no later than this Sunday so we can know who will be coming back and who won't be. We are very excited for the return to campus and we're gonna have a lot more information to come. Keep up the good work, Lions. We can't wait to welcome you back to Eastside High School. I also wanna give a big shout out to all our academic award recipients at last week's academic awards. We missed not having you in the gym, celebrating you in person, but we really, we really were proud of all of your accomplishments. We can't wait to welcome you back to the gym to celebrate you in person next year. Great job, Lions. Thanks, Principal Dunn. We had a great opportunity last week to interview an eight-time U.S. national champion distance runner, Mohamed Trafe. Mohamed goes into detail about his path to become an elite distance runner and the challenges he faced in the process. His story and accomplishments are both entertaining and inspiring for anyone with big dreams. Click on the link above to watch the in interview in its entirety. Speaking of great athletes, we are happy to present Gonzalez Y Gonzalez Bubble Match 20. Force equals mass times acceleration. There's a lot of mass in there. <laughs> There's a lot of mass in there. So Gonzalez with an S, how do you think you did? I, I think I did a good job. It was pretty close. A couple times I went in there, I knew I had him. My foot slipped a little bit, but I think overall, I would call it a draw. Mr. Gonzalez with a Z, how do you think you did? Well, you know, um, I didn't realize uh, Mr. Gonzalez was so strong and quick, but um, we had a good match. You know, we both gave 100% and you guys will just have to wait and see. But who I really want to go against next is Charles Principal, Mr. Dunn. What about you and uh, Gonzalez? Are you guys still enemies? I know, we're cool. I think we're good. So Ed, do you wanna? Go on the slide. Wow, Gonzalez with a Z really did show us all who the real Gonzalez is at EHS. He's now the big, big man on campus. Great job. Who would you like to see battle out in the bubble match next? Let us know in the comments below. And now, Miss Stone Rock with Biomed Birthday. Happy, happy birthday from Biomed to you. We wish you was our birthday so we could party too. Woo! Thank you for joining us on this episode of the Biomed Bulletin. Congratulations to Diego Morales on being named Senior of the Month. 
I'm Mr. Gomez. And I'm Mr. Gonzalez, reminding you to stay safe and have a great spring break. Thank you for watching. To stay up with all your news needs, subscribe to our YouTube channel at GoEdTechGo, on TikTok at GoGoTakeOver, and on Instagram at EastsideBioMed. This has been a Big Slaps production.